Hi, I'm Evan Woodruff and today at Gordon Harris, New Zealand's art and graphics store, we're going to look at a selection of drawing and painting papers. Drawing and sketching paper from German manufacturer Hahnemuller is available in flat sheets, in handy packs and it's the same paper they use in their 140 gram DNS journals. It's what we'd commonly call a cartridge paper, it's archival, it's very cost effective and it can handle a wide range of materials. Drawing and sketching paper has a beautiful fine grain to it, suitable for all dry media effects. Working back into it with an eraser, doesn't fur it up much at all. And this paper is also suitable for quick watercolour sketches. And here we have one of my personal favourites, Fabriano Artistico. It's 100% pure rag paper, which means it has a very good wet strength, and it's available in a hot press, cold press, which I have here, and rough textures. It's also available in three different weights, 200 gram, 300 gram, which is also available as a pad, and this beautiful sturdy 640 gram paper, which is almost like a cardboard. It's great for a range of painting techniques, watercolour, acrylic painting, and uh, if, you, if you gesso it up, very good for oil painting, it makes a beautiful drawing paper as well. Fabriano Artistico is made by Italian producer Fabriano since 1264 AD. And you can tell a really high quality paper by this decal here, which is made in the mold made process, and also by the watermark that you get in it here. Artistico is specially good for watercolour effects as it holds the colour and the water without much movement at all. Here one of the new colours from Schmenker Cobalt Violet Hue. And finally let's look at Stella Matte which is a very hard drawing paper from Hanamula. You can hear that toughness when you flick the edge of it. Hard papers are especially good for drawing when you're really going to work the surface. So for dry media, which you might be scraping back into, erasing and using blending stumps and tortillas. While not ideal for watercolour, you can use ink and all dry media on Stella Mat, especially when you want to lay down some really dense graphite, charcoal and drawing chalks. It has a very fine grain and an excellent a razor resistant surface, which means I can work right back into it without furring the surface. I can even use some very fine 600 grit wet and dry sandpaper here to polish the surface without furring up the paper. Matching paper to process is really important and with over a hundred different papers in store, check with our staff to find out which one's perfect for you. Thanks for watching, my name's Evan Woodruff and you can find out more on www.gordonharris.co.nz